In this video, I'm going to show you how to customize dataset markers in GeoPoint. By default, mapped markers will appear in a single color on the map. So I'm going to load this leads dataset that I have set up, and you'll notice that all of the markers are blue. So what I'm going to do is color these markers by the lead rating. I'm going to start by hovering over the dataset so the layer options menu appears, and then click Edit Dataset. Now we're going to navigate to the Markers tab, and you'll see it's set with this marker type of static. I could always change this marker color and add icons if I want, but all the markers are going to look the same. We'd like to color the markers based on the rating field, so I'm going to select Single Field as my marker type. And you'll see GeoPoint automatically generates marker colors for pick list uh, fields. And you'll see we have hot, warm, and cold colors, but I'd like to customize these. You can do that by just clicking on the marker and then clicking on the color box. I'm going to make my hot leads red, my cold leads blue, and my warm leads orange. And if you already know the hex value of the color you want to use, you can just enter that manually here. You can also add icons for each of the values. And you'll notice that my organization actually uploaded some custom icons that we can use. And there's also an option to enter custom text. I think I'm happy with the marker colors that I selected, so I'm going to click Save. And let's reload this leads data set. You can see now that the markers are colored. I can instantly get a perspective on the value of these leads just by glancing at the map. And if we switch to our mapped layers tab, we can use more visualization options here. Click show legend to see how those values were set up. And we can also do the same thing by clicking the Map Legend tab. We can achieve real-time filtering by toggling the values on and off. I'm going to show you real quick a couple other marker customization options. I'm going to edit that data set again. Let's wipe this clean and try doing a multiple fields marker type. It's going to remove the values we set, but that's okay. Let's try this again with the same rating field for our colors, and then we also want to set an icon field so we can visualize the industry. So now you see GeoPoint has automatically generated icons based on the values of the industry field. And the final option is label only. With this, you can pick a field to display with a text label instead of representing it with pictures or colors. So if we wanted, we could just have that rating be displayed with text instead. To learn more about dataset customizations, check out the articles on our help site.